Welcome to Audio Media Channel. This is Hello Kumar from Audio Media Education. We are proud to unveil or unbox the first color camera in India or possibly in South India. The camera itself has a 5K sensor. At 5K is good only for stills. Can do uh, 6 frames per second still shooting. 4K is for video. Uh, you can do 30 frames per second at 4K. Then we can shoot at 3K, uh, 48 frames per second speed. Uh, 2K is, uh, could be done at 60 frames per second. And uh, 1K at a startling 120 frames per second. So you can do real good slow motions at 1K and 2K, uh, which is the resolution of uh, most of the cameras that are available in the market from Sony, Panasonic and other people. They could only do maximum 2K, whereas this camera can do up to 5K. And it's so small and so handy. If you see here, there's a SSD slot, which will take a 64 GB, 128 GB or 250 GB SSD card which could uh, record all the videos and you can play back the media, play back whatever you are recorded on the camera through the touch LCD screen. Now let's put the touch LCD screen onto the camera. I am now unboxing the retro 5 inch touch screen uh, LCD screen. So this is the screen. This is the Scarlett with the LCD monitor fitted in. Uh, this LCD monitor is used for viewing the frame. Plus also it could be used to focus, sort of focus the Canon LCD lenses. It could be used to control all the menus and uh, all the functions of the camera. This is the red mode. This is a remote control for the red camera. All the operations of the camera could be controlled from 30 to 40 feet away from the camera even. So uh, instead of using the touch LCD, uh, suppose the camera is uh, mounted on a, a crane or something like that, uh, you can use the red mode to control all the functions uh, of the camera including the, it has a record button to record uh, the video. Uh, and other time it could be mounted onto the camera just like this. So you can see the display on the red mode and you can control all the functions of the camera from here. The aperture, focus, zoom, everything could become uh, controlled directly from the red mode. Now we come to the best part of everything, your image quality depends on the lenses. So this camera comes with a Canon mount. There's also a PL mount option. Uh, if you are using PL mount lenses, uh, we could remove this mount and just with four screws you can attach the PL mount and it will be ready to shoot with PL mount. Now this camera has got Canon mount so we will look at how to mount the lenses onto the camera. Now. You are seeing a collection of uh, L series lenses. This is the 1635 2.8L Mark II lens. This is one of Canon's most popular 2470L series lens with aperture opening of 2.8. This is the awesome 85 1.2 lens. It gives a real black background blurring because of the 1.2 aperture. This is the 7200 Mark II lens. Again aperture opening of f2.8. This is the latest fisheye lens. The A216 L series f4 fisheye lens. This is the 135mm f2 prime lens. It's a very very sharp lens. One of the sharpest lens from Canon. This is the 100 400 
zoom lens. Again, I will see this lens aperture f4 to f5.6. This is a 24 105 f4 IS lens, and this finally is the Zeiss 50 mm prime lens. Now, let's mount the 24 70 lens under the camera. So it's ready for action. Thank you for watching this video. This is Halokma from Audio Media Education. We like to announce that we will be doing more videos, more test videos. We will be testing this camera with a cinematographer Manoj Paramahamsa and Mr. Madhu Ambat. So stay tuned, subscribe our channel and you will be seeing a lot of interesting stuff on our channel. You will be seeing a lot of videos on Red Scarlet. Thank you.